Welcome back to Blockchain Pill. My name is Alex, and today we'll learn how to stake your ICP in under five minutes. So let's go. So, the first thing we have to do is to head over to Definity's NNS, which stands for Network Nervous System, which is one of the world's largest DAOs and it governs the Internet Computer Protocol. The staking rewards are given out to people who are voting on proposals to update the internet computer. What we wanna do is we wanna head to the NNS and to click on the sign in with internet identity. This will prompt us to create an internet identity if we don't have one already, which I assume we don't. Click on create internet identity, add a pass key. Here it will ask for our computer pin or if you will have one of those fancy USB sticks, you can use that, but I will use the computer pin. Complete the captcha and just like that, you created an internet identity in what less than one minute this number right here is your internet identity you don't want to lose this number if you lose it you will not have access to your internet identity make sure you save it somewhere in a safe place this is not a secret number it is unique and it's yours and only yours we will save this and we click i saved and continue we can create a recovery phrase for our internet identity it's similar to the recovery phrase that you usually get when you create a crypto wallet we don't really need it right now but but, you know it's good just to have it so that you can get access back to your uh, internet identity cool now we go to the nns dashboard where we will be staking our internet computer protocol when you stake your icp you need to lock it for a set amount of time and the longer you lock it the bigger your apr so we can start at half a year so six months the apr is nine percent and as we go longer two years four years, 12%, six years, almost 15%, and the longest one is eight years, we get around 17% APR. First of all, we need to have some ICP on our account to be able to stake it. So in order to get ICP on your account, you need to send it either from another wallet or from an exchange. I will send a couple ICP from an exchange to my wallet and uh, we'll be back in just a second. As soon as you send your ICP from a different wallet or exchange, it should get to your internet identity in a couple of seconds because the network is just so quick, so fast. And there it is. That was what, like five seconds? It's already here. What you wanna make sure is that you send a little bit more than one ICP because the minimum amount that you can stake in the NNS is one ICP. There is no upper limit, but the, the minimum amount is one ICP. Now we have one point zero one icp we go to my neuron staking here on the left stake neurons click on max then we create the neuron perfect and now here is where we decide how long we want to stake the neuron for so we can go all the way from zero to eight years in this case this neuron i will stake for eight years we get the maximum rewards so we just click set delay we get the neuron id the voting power and the balance inside of this neuron confirm and set delay and just just like that, we staked our ICP in a new run. In order to get the rewards for staking your ICP, you will need to vote on NNS proposals that upgrade the internet computer protocol. But the thing is, you don't have to vote yourself. You can follow other neurons and then your neuron follows their vote and you get the rewards without having to do any clicking. There is a list of named neurons that you can follow. On top of the list, there is the Definity Foundation and the Internet Computer Association. You can follow them because they usually vote on every proposals, but there also are some other named neurons from active people in the ICP ecosystem that you can follow. Make sure you follow at least two, three, four people just to be sure that your votes are being cast. Whether or not the vote is rejected or it passes, it doesn't really matter. All that matters is if you voted and that's how you're getting the rewards. Every day after you vote on proposals, depending on how much ICP you have staked, you're gonna receive some amount of maturity. Then you go here and click on spawn neuron and you just click on that and in seven days it will release your ICP. You can either spawn it or merge it on top of your existing neuron to make it bigger. In order to ever see the ICP inside this neuron again, we need to click on the neuron and click on start dissolving. If we don't click start dissolving, even if eight year pass, you will not get your ICP back because you didn't start to dissolve it. So we click on the neuron, we click on start dissolving. In eight years, I will be getting this ICP out. Imagine even what price ICP will be in eight years. Definitely looking forward to that. What if I want to get my ICP out of this neuron quicker? Is there a way to do it? Well, there is actually a way to do it. On ID Geek, 
you can sell your internet identity with the assets inside it for a discount. Usually the eight year neurons are being sold for 20, 25% discount. Let's look at some of the activity. So this neuron with 704 ICP sold for 539. So that's, that's what like exactly a 20% discount. This is a really big one, which sold 23,000 ICP and it's sold for 17,200 ICP, which is exactly a 25% discount. So this is a, a really good option to get some of your ICP back from, from the neuron if you cannot wait the eight years that you wanted to wait. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and found it useful. If you did, don't forget to like it and to subscribe to our channel to see more videos like this. My name is Alex and I'll see you in the next video.